Hi, now post 1st of October Iranian attack on Israel which was uh, by almost 180 missiles they used for it. Uh, there were speculations that there will be quick response by Israel and that's what actually Israel said. Uh, then I was also actually expecting that Israeli response will come on or before the anniversary of October 7. But it is being paused or delayed and uh, we are analyzing why it happened. I am not saying that uh, I know exactly, it's just my analysis, it's my you can say speculation but not a speculation my analysis and there are probabilities why it has not happened till now it might also happen anytime even while we are talking it might happen first of all there might be a delay due to united states of america because there is an election season going on a very important election uh, and a lot is on stake for both Democrats as well as Republicans and uh, the uh, we have always talked about one thing in US politics it's economy idiot uh, what they call it uh, so if there is a full-fledged war between Iran and Israel then inflation will soar and the worst thing will happen to uh, the Democrats will be rising figures of inflation and that will cost them very dearly. So there might this might be a reason that uh, United States of America do not want a rapid retaliation and there are some negotiations going on between Israel and United States. Then secondly, the Arab countries. Uh, well, Arab countries uh, I don't think that they are very important but in this case they might be important because uh, like in case of Jordan they have said or other countries also can uh, be in this framework uh, that they are not going to support Israel by using their airspace and they will uh, be neutral uh, because definitely if uh, Israel is using their airspace then Iran might attack on them as well so uh, and the distance between Israel and Iran is almost 2000 kilometers so uh, for attacking uh, Iran by F-35s or F-16s or advanced versions of them uh, definitely e Israel will want to use their airspace which they are not allowing and if they are not allowing then the Israel will have to take uh, the uh, uh, routes above the oceans and in that case they will need refueling and that can be done only with the help of United States of America and if US is exerting pressure that delay it or do not do it right now because of the elections this might be a reason behind this pause uh, then there is a possibility that uh, since there are various reports see these reports are never confirmed uh, there are reports that russia has already supplied s 400 missile system anti-missile system air defense system to the iranians then they have also supplied the very dangerous iskander missiles then they have also supplied electronic warfare system they uh, there are reports that uh, uh, some time back some years back they already sold uh, is, uh, uh, Iranians and actually they launched for the Iranians uh, uh, their uh, uh, military uh, uh, satellite so Iranians are I think already having or if even they are not having there are reports that Russia is assisting them in giving satellite intelligence and uh, some time back there were actually rumors or reports whatever we can call that uh, some days back uh, F-16 flew uh, towards uh, Iran but uh, it, it went back again because there was a military intelligence given by Russia so the Russian involvement might have uh, might be a reason behind this pause or stop uh, and we also know one thing that just before this uh, October 1st uh, Iranian missile attack on Israel uh, the Russian Prime Minister was there in Tehran and he can't be there without the permission of Kremlin or Mr. Putin before that it was Sergei Shoigu over there and uh, uh, e even on 11th of October uh, in the meeting between Russia and 
दो सेंट्रल एशियन स्थान्स कंट्रीज विच यूज टू बी पार्ट ऑफ यू एस एस आर पुतिन हैज इन्वाइटेड ईरानियन प्रेसिडेंट टू तजिकिस्तान तजिकिस्तान कैपिटल अशकाबाद एंड दिस शोज अ वेरी बिग सिग्नल दट रशिया इज स्टैंडिंग विथ ईरान एंड वाई शुड नॉट इट स्टैंड बिकॉज ड्यूरिंग द यूक्रेनियन वॉर एंटायर वेस्ट वर्क अगेंस्ट ईरान एंड दे स्टूड विथ यूक्रेन एंड ईरान द टाइम सपोर्टेड वेरी ओपनली रशिया सो आई थिंक इट्स अ टाइम फॉर पे बैक एंड इट विल बी इन रशियन इंटरेस्ट नेशनल इंटरेस्ट टू गो फॉर अ प्रोक्सी वॉर विज वी वेस्ट और स्पेशली अमेरिका बाय सप्लाइंग आर्म्स एंड इंटर